this T-shirt, which was created in response to the London 2012 Olympic Games, was taken down at our request because we found out this design museum was hiring a private room and hosting events with arms dealers, namely Leonardo. Leonardo was heavily involved in arms deals with Bahrain. Today is a message that this is a shameful action that you're having uh, arms deals with the repressive regimes. This is our object that was in the exhibition. It's uh, rough in the shape of the BP logo. So because it's an object about ethical funding, we had to take it off the walls. We got in touch with a few other people that we knew had art in the exhibition and it just snowballed from there. I, I certainly don't want my work to be viewed during a jolly by arms dealers at, at the museum. Really, it's not just about us, it's about all of our brothers and sisters in other parts of the world that we can't let down and we have to support, and this is one of the ways that we support them. To somehow pretend that this art hasn't been done under duress and that it should be entertainment for those that are responsible for the killing. It's akin to really serving cocktails on the backs of the nearly 500,000 Syrians who've been killed by the conflict. This is the first time that artists have actually withdrawn their work from a museum uh, in protest at an attempted kind of art washing by the arms industry. So I think it's a real tipping point for the sector that other museums should be listening and paying attention to these events, that they tell you something about the shift in the acceptability of the oil industry and the arms industry um, in kind of public debate.